This past weekend, there was some interesting Apple news regarding their WWDC 2017 conference, which happens at the beginning of June. A well-respected uh, KGI security analyst who reports on Apple frequently came out with a note that basically said, uh, this year, unlike previous years, Apple's going to be launching two hardware products uh, at WWDC, a new iPad Pro and a Siri wireless speaker. Uh, so the first thing about the iPad Pro, uh, this is going to be allegedly a very new form factor at 10.5 inches. It'll actually fit into the same form factor as the 9.7 inch iPad Pro, uh, but have a vastly redesigned uh, screen basically, and it'll be bezel-less. So this kind of is in line with iPhone 8 rumors, and of course the Galaxy S8 that have very low bezel uh, designs. Uh, it'll be powered by an A10 chip. Obviously it's the pretty much the same upgrade cycle. Uh, and it'll be likely the same price points as the 9.7 inch iPad Pro. Now the KGI security analyst says that there's a 70% chance that this launches at WWDC. I have two initial thoughts on the matter. Number one, I think this iPad that they're describing is 100% real and one, will 100% launch at some point. However, my other reaction is I don't really, I'm a little surprised to hear about WWDC as the launch time. What made a lot more sense to me was for Apple to have the brand new design, bezel-less design, with the iPhone 8, and then sometime next year launch an iPad Pro uh, that then followed suit and gained that bezel-less design and also gained 3D Touch. Uh, you know, 70% chance seems pretty high, so maybe I'm wrong. It also could make sense that they're going to switch their normal cycle instead of having the iPhone improvements first with iPad uh, following suit later. Maybe iPad sales have been going down recently, they have if you look at their financials, so maybe it makes sense that they change that cycle and bring out a very revolutionary iPad Pro now. Um, but we'll see at WWDC, which again is in the beginning of June. So the next uh, thing, the next product that may be coming out at a WWDC, about a 50-50 chance actually, is the uh, Siri speaker. So it's going to be similar to an Amazon Echo, it'll have always on Siri capabilities, so you'll be able to talk right to Siri to play music, ask for the weather, uh, prop, maybe pr make purchases. Um, it seems like a very interesting idea. A lot of people enjoy their Amazon Echoes. I personally don't have one. I think the big thing though is Siri is going to have to improve in its intelligence a lot more uh, for this to make sense, right? Because I think Siri uh, kind of started at one of the first big uh, AI assistance in phones and iPads, etc. I think there's been a, it's a lagged a lot, and I think Apple uh, really needs to improve it so it's more context aware, so it can do more things, it can connect to more applications. And I think once it does that, this will make a lot more sense. Um, again, it's about a 50-50 shot for coming out at WWDC, and even that at that point, it's also rumored that even if they do announce it, it might not launch until later in 2017. Uh, there's also a rumor that it'll possibly include a touch panel. There's been rumors about that as well as uh, comments uh, that Apple executives made about Amazon Echo Tech that had to do with basically how sometimes it's really nice to speak to the device, but sometimes you want to actually be able to touch. Uh, no word, of course, these are all very speculative rumors about the specifics of the Siri speaker, but no word yet if the touch panel means a full touch display, capacitive multi-touch display, or if it means touch-sensitive buttons on there. Either way, WWDC is right around the corner. I look forward to possibly seeing both these products. Again, these are both products that uh, hearing about a launch at WWDC was kind of surprising because that's more software focused of late. Um, but they're both products that I am 100% sure are in the works and will be very interesting to see how useful they are and innovative once they come out. So if you liked this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up just so I know, and click subscribe if you haven't already so more iPad Pro, Siri Speaker, and other videos come right to your YouTube homepage. Thanks for watching.